Hi, Mark from Whole Latte Love. I'm here with Andrea from Quamar Grinders. He's visiting Hi, from Italy. Um, we've got your manual grinder here. Yes. Let's talk a little bit. Show us how that gets set up, uh, some of the features. Okay. First of all, this is a small OPA because mm -hmm. Volatile Love, they like a small grinder, so we put a small so feet. People can fit it under cabinets. Absolutely. In the home. Yeah. But if you want, if you need, you can have a big OPA. So we do sell the bigger hopper Absolutely. separately. Yes. 1.2 kilo, half a kilo. Okay. It's up to your customer what they prefer. Uh, let's talk about how you'd set this up. Now, first, the burrs on this, what, what are the first burrs? Thing, first thing to check is first, is a manual. So mm -hmm. press on and off. And that's, that's it? That's it. Yeah. When you turn on, you just, the most important, the bar, they touch one of the mm -hmm. other. And on the beginning, the first step is to a quarter of turn. A quarter turn, so about fi five on here. Exactly. Go, go because five. in here, there is between zero and 20. So 20. you have to share in four. So the first quarter, and after you can start. And this is the beginning. So you get those burrs touching just slightly, exactly. and then turn five coarser, and that's a good place to start maybe exactly. to get your grind fresh. Between a quarter, you can move in a couple of number more, in a couple of mo um, under less. Right. But m you have done the grinding, the 80% is already done the job. Sure. So you need the 20% because we don't know which tough coffee you put inside. If okay. it's 100% Arabic, it's just a Robusta or whatever right. is the mix. Right. Very easy because you just press on, mm -hmm. press off. This is the safety. Okay. So the people, they can put the finger inside. Mm -hmm. As soon as you have the dozer, you, you level one time, two yeah. times if it's single or if it's double. Mm -hmm. So the shot is seven and a half gram. Mm -hmm. And after, if you check the doser, you know, seven and a half or seven, or you want to do maybe more or maybe less, it's mm -hmm. up to you. You just turn this. And I, you know, I, I like this compared to some other dosers I've seen where you really have to reach down in there, but this knob is up nice and high. You don't have to remove anything to do any you adjustment. Don't have, when you don't have, when you have to do the dose, you don't need key, you right. don't need screwdriver, you don't need nothing. Okay. Two finger. Job easy, done. Very easy. Easy to do it for the customer and easy to do it for the service. Sure. Because the service is important and mm -hmm. cost them money. Less problem you have, less money the customer spend. Sure. Now, in the burrs on this, let's, what kind of burrs do we have? The bar is a 63 flat bar and okay. you can do three kilo per day. Also this, very easy to fix and to put the grinder. You can take maximum two minutes and you can change the blade. With okay. one blade, you can do 400 kilo. 400 kilos? Yes, so. it's 400, ki 400 kilo is the range where you have to stay so the grinder, the grinding of the coffee, which is high quality. Okay. More high you go, mm. less quality you have in a coffee. Gotcha. So, so if you're grinding a kilo a day, say in a cafe, you're replacing these burrs. Uh, one time a year. It's one easy. Time or, you know, so. what I say right. to all our customers, it's easy to change one time a year. So sure. your client, they are happy because the level of the, the knife, they are always high level. And so high level of the knife, high level of the product, sure. high level on the top. So the in, in for home use, if, I mean, you might go 10 years on a burr set. I tell you one thing, uh, even if uh, you do for 300 kilo, yeah. my opinion still uh, change no when uh, every 10 year. Yeah, okay. Just because like if you use, is okay. Like this machine, they are a professional. Maybe in a house they use less. Right. I you suggest, okay, no every year because uh, yeah. throw away the money is not, right. but every two year and a half just to check if make it's sure. Ev make sure is everything okay because you know maybe they wrong something and everything it's better to do a checkup mm -hmm. as soon as you do the checkup and you look is okay you can say for many years but every one year one year and a half is better if you just open check is everything okay they working and so you still have a good quality good coffee in a high level Okay. Andre, thank you very much. Thank you very much. For showing us the manual. Uh, look for other videos. We're going to take a look at the timer and the uh, on demand of course. as well. Okay. And if you give me a screw, I can show you how to change the blade. We will do that. Okay. okay. Thank, thank you. you. The number one source for everything coffee, wholelattelove.com.